Welcome back to my channel, Storytime Tuber. Today I will be reading I Am a Cat by Galia Bernstein. Let's begin. Hello, my name is Simon. I am a cat, just like you. <laughs> a cat? said Lion. Don't be silly, dear boy. You can't be a cat because I am a cat and you are nothing like me at all. Cats have a mane and a tuft at the end of their tails. And when they roar, everybody trembles for they are the kings of all beasts. A cat? said Cheetah. But you are so short and chubby. Cats are tall and graceful creatures who run faster than all the animals in the world. You don't look like you can run very fast at all. A cat? said Puma. That's ridiculous. Cats live in the mountains. That's why people call us mountain lions. They leap far, jump high, and act tough. I know fuzzy little rabbits that look tougher than you. A cat? Cats are black, said Panther. They live in jungles and rainforests and sleep in trees. Have you ever even seen a jungle? A cat, said Tiger. That's very funny. You see, cats are very big and very strong and very, very orange. You are small and gray. You might be some kind of rat, but a cat? I don't think so. Simon was confused. Lion is the only one with a mane, he said. No one else is black like panther or orange like tiger. No one else can jump as high as puma or can run as fast as cheetah. So how can you all be cats? Because we also have many things in common, said lion. We all have small, perky ears and flat noses. Long whiskers and long tails. We have sharp teeth and claws. And big eyes that can see in the dark. So do I, said Simon. I have all of those things, only smaller. They all leaned in for a closer look. Ah, said Lion. Oh, said Puma. Um, in that case, said Panther. Er, uh, it's very possible that, said Tiger. You're a cat, said Cheetah. So, I'm part of the family, asked Simon. The big cat looked at one another. Yes, they all said together. And they spent the rest of the day pouncing and prowling, prancing and playing, like cats of all sizes do. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this book. Until next time, let's read again. Bye!